Before anything else, let me give you the objective of today's lesson. In this session, we are going to identify the festivals and theatrical forms celebrated in China, Japan, Thailand, and Indonesia. This time, grab your pen and paper because we will have an activity to check what you already know about the lesson. In this activity, I will present different videos. Then, try to identify the Asian festivals and theatrical forms by filling out the word news. Your time is up! Very good! The correct answer is China Spring Festival. That's correct! The answer is Taika Drum Festival. You got it right! It's Kabuki Theater of Japan. Excellent! The answer is Nang Puppet Shadow of Thailand. Brilliant! That festival is called Aswayan Kulit of Indonesia. Great job, class! Have your shoulders for doing that. What other information do you need to remember in Asian Festival? Let's continue. First, let's take a look to the Chinese Spring Festival. The Chinese Spring Festival is also known as Chinese New Year. The Dragon Dance is the highlight of this festival which is celebrated in China fans around the world. The dragon symbolizes power, strength, and good luck. It's so colorful, isn't it? Very good! Now, let's also talk about the Taiko Drum Festival of Japan. Kodo is a professional taiko drumming troupe. Drums were used in ancient times to signify the boundaries of villages in Japan. Drums were used to pray for rain and in other religious ceremonies. Can you imagine the sound? Very good! At this point, let's proceed to the theatrical forms. Have you ever seen a puppet shadow show? On the screen, you are looking at the picture of the Nang Puppet Shadow of Thailand. Shadow puppetry is one form of public entertainment in the south of Thailand. The shadow theater is sometimes called Nang Yai or Nang Talung. The characters such as gods and goddesses, kings and queens, magical figures, and comedians have a religious theme or contain an episode from the Ramayana epic. Next, let's also learn about the Wayang Kulit of Indonesia. Wayang Kulit is an ancient Indonesian art of shadow play. Lazy shadow images are projected on a linen screen with a coconut oil lamp or electric light. Finally, let's take a look at the Kabuki Theater. Kabuki is a form of traditional Japanese drama with highly stylized song, meme, and dance. Today, it is performed only by male actors. Interesting, right? Good job! You have just learned the festival and the ethical forms celebrated in China, Japan, Thailand, and Indonesia. This time, let us find out if you can still remember 
what you have learned in this session. In this activity, you are going to identify what kind of Asian festival or theatrical form being described. Are you ready? Let's begin! It is a form of traditional Japanese drama with highly stylish song, meme, and dance. Very good! It is Kabuki Theater of Japan. Ready for the next one? Let's go! It is also known as the Chinese New Year. The Dragon Dance is the highlight of this festival which is celebrated in China towns around the world. Great! It is Chinese Spring Festival. Here is the last one. It is an ancient Indonesian art of shadow play. Correct! The answer is Wayang Kulit of Indonesia. Remember, theater arts and festivals represents the cultural and national identity of the country and conveys people's daily life. That ends our session in this episode. I hope that you have learned a lot today. Again, this is Teacher Debbie, your art teacher saying, Culture is a way of life, where celebration is timeless. Keep celebrating! Bye!